Hello students, I am Dr. Tanmay Vishash. I welcome you all in my channel Chemistry the Mystery of Molecules. Today's topic of discussion is one MCQ about clays and rearrangement. So you can see allyl ethers upon heating produces this tri-substituted product. Fine. If you are able to say that what is the percentage of label distribution, label means this is carbon 14 here. So this A and B means what is the relative percentage of A and B. If you can try I request you student please do it and whatever answer you get please in write in the comment box along with few words as explanation and don't worry after some time I shall give you the right answer and I shall be very happy if you do it okay and after some time we'll definitely get the right answer but at the beginning let me tell you student that this is really a difficult problem it's very difficult problem so that's why I suggest you if you don't understand the problem at the first time Please watch it again in the second time, third time repeatedly. This is difficult. So I guess you should understand, try to understand. So, so this is student actually, this reaction is Claisen rearrangement. And remember few points that Claisen rearrangement is ortho selective. But if the ortho is blocked, then first Claisen, second cope rearrangement to produce the para substitution. And in this case, here what happened this Claisen rearrangement plus cope rearrangement. So two happens and ultimately produces this one and label distribution. Before calculating the label we need to understand the mechanism. So first step how this reaction happens. So these part student is responsible for the chemical reaction just let me tell you. So and remember in benzene double bond is delocalized here I have shown one but there could be another where double bond at this position so it doesn't mat matter so there are two chances two chances means these allyl group either could be shifted here and this part I have shown here and there could be another chances means these allyl group could be shifted here also okay so how this happens means let me discuss first this option so in this way what it will produce so it will produce so first step it will this aromaticity will go and it will produce this along with this and here this with this label and in next step means this cope rearrangement in the second phase means heating it will produce so ultimately aromaticity will be gained don't worry at the end so i am not going that much details this this and here this so this is the final product and label is intact here because this site was unaffected or unreacted okay so it will be the product fine this one and second second option as i told that this could be shifted here so it will be produced now here a point to be discussed student that so 50 percent chance this side and 50 percent chance this side this is clear so now let's discuss what about the second thing means if you look at in the second from where we are starting we are starting from here this we are starting from this now there is one level now remember this level is actually 14 C means isotope and we know isotopes have similar chemical property okay so migration from either this or these both have equal probability equal probability means you can change 50% and 50% plus 50% now so what will be the product let me draw it so when this radio label means this part let's name a this part is b so when path a is followed it will produce ultimately means second one is obviously the cope rearrangement ultimately produce this this is the oh this is and this is now here the label position will be here why this label will come here just see how the reaction sorry I made mistake in distributing double bond here so it must be here and here so how this reaction happens so you can think that these double bond will go here 
it will come here and this will so so in this way you can understand just look at this part this is new alk information this part and at the end this is the level so that's why level comes here fine so this is and what is the another product formation possible so obviously phenol this is means chemically both are same only the level and level will remain as its prime position so here 50 percent here 50 percent as i told at the beginning now just consider what is the initial percentage in the reaction mixture of this one it was 50 percent so if it is 50 percent then obviously it will be divided by 2 it will be divided by 2 so here 25 percent here 25 percent fine now let's go back to this so here 50 percent we have so we are starting 50 percent so distribution here will be 25 percent and means sorry not 25 percent uh, in the, from here what will be produced 25 percent 25 percent but just calculate this position this 50 percent directly can come here so it is 50 percent so level at this position will be 25 percent plus 50 percent so now level at this ortho position is 75 percent okay because in the first step level was here means 50 percent level was at here and when this happened from here 50 percent and from this 50 percent half was migrated here means 25 percent so already here 25 percent because of this step and because of other side 50 percent so that's why 75 percent 50 plus 25 75 and here 25 so what is the distribution of a and b so if a and B, A means here 75 percent, B here migration 25 percent, A is 75 percent, now look at here and B is 25 percent, so option is C, so this is the answer. Now if you ask me that sir, how can I solve this question less than 30 seconds, I will say student, in this case I do not have any tricks. Here practice, understanding and again practice and in this way you can reduce the duration for such questions. And uh, I suggest you student, if you have any confusion, try to attempt such question later. In first do those easy questions. This is relatively difficult. Uh, but if you understand and uh, let me tell you, if you understand the concept, it's actually very easy. Okay. So 50% this side, 50% this side and half of these will go to para. So here 25% overall here will remain 75% less than 10 seconds possible. But you need to study much that's why i suggest to student study as much as possible okay now so in conclusion what you have learned today that claisen rearrangement is actually a 3-3 sigma topic rearrangement and claisen rearrangement mainly results in ortho substitution if ortho position is blocked then para migration occur and this step is called cope rearrangement and it is important method for carbon carbon bond formation actually from carbon oxygen to this carbon carbon bond formation occur in this uh, rearrangement is in terms of heat and remember student in all content of phenol is 100% because of aromaticity and aromaticity is huge stabilization energy that's why in case of this aromatic system the enol content is complete but in general if you look at in case of keto and enol tautomerism these tautomerism prefers to remain towards this keto side because this carbon double bond oxygen is relatively more stable compared to this Okay, and another interesting information, this radiocarbon is actually a beta emitter and it has a half-life of 5730 plus minus 40 years. Okay, so this is the end of discussion. I thank you all for watching and if you really consider my contents are worthy, then please help this channel to grow. See you in my next video. Bye-bye. Take care.